In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can download Microsoft SharePoint videos using the ShareDown application. I'll also explain the steps to install FFmpeg and YTDLP, which are the supporting applications required for this process. As you can see, we are not able to download this video directly from the website. However, I'll provide you a solution by which you can download such a video using the open source programs. First, we need to download and install the ShareDown application. You can find the link for the ShareDown's GitHub repository in the description box below. Go to Releases and download the latest version of ShareDown's executable file. Once you've downloaded the application, Run the installer and follow the on-screen instructions to complete the installation process. When you launch the application, you will see that it shows an error. Therefore, in order to run this program properly, first we'll need to install FFmpeg as well. FFmpeg is a cross-platform tool used for handling multimedia files. You can download FFmpeg from their GitHub's releases. The link will be in the description. Once downloaded, extract the contents of the file to a folder of your choice. After that, create a new folder in your system disk and name it whatever you want. Copy and paste the content from the bin folder to this new folder you just created. Then, add the path of this folder to your system environment variables. This will ensure that the system can find the FFmpeg executable. Finally, you can confirm that you've successfully added this folder's path by typing FFmpeg in Windows PowerShell and pressing Enter. Now, 
Now, if we run the share down application, we see that it still shows an error. Therefore, finally, we need to install YTDLP in order to run this. YTDLP is a command line program used for downloading videos from various websites. You can download YTDLP from their GitHub's releases. Once downloaded, copy and paste this executable file in the folder that you have added the path of in your system environment variables. And that's it. Now that we have installed all the necessary applications, let's move on to the main process of downloading Microsoft SharePoint videos using ShareDown. Launch the ShareDown application, and now you can see that our application is running successfully this time. You can play with the settings here if you want to. In order to download the video, click on the Add button in order to paste the URL of your video. You can also add multiple URLs at once. Click on the Start button to start the downloading process. This will redirect you to your sign up page. After you have filled your credentials, your video will start downloading. You can monitor the progress of the download in the progress bar. Once your download has completed, you can find it in your downloads folder. I hope this video was helpful to you. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave them in the comment section below.